Good morning, my sisters and brothers in Christ. This is Sister Bernanda Williams with Tacoma Christian Center, and I have the scripture of the day. Today's scripture, it says, do your best to present yourself to God as one approved, a worker who has no need to be ashamed, rightly handling the word of truth, 2 Timothy 2.15. Now, this is the New International Version. The King James Version says, show thyself. Show thyself to God as one approved. So my question to you, my sisters and brothers, is are you a God pleaser or are you a people pleaser? We do not serve to please people. We serve to please God. We are not ashamed at the fact that we serve to please God and that we walk in boldness and faith, studying diligently to use the discernment that he blesses us with to know right from wrong. My sisters and brothers, present ourselves. Paul was telling Timothy that the world would bring distractions to make him please people. But for Timothy to use his discernment to know that his job is to please God, and that's our job. The world is gonna throw many distractions our way to make us think we have to play, please people to be approved. But we need to please God and show ourselves approved. A worker who has no need to be ashamed. There's no need to be ashamed of the gospel. There's no need to be ashamed of your faith. There's great joy in rightfully handling the word of truth because God's word is the word of truth. God is our real supervisor, our manager, our boss. He provides, he provided that job. He blessed us with that job that we've prayed for, that perfect job that we want. He blesses us with our heart's desire when it's the right thing, because there are times that he won't because it's not the right thing. So my sisters and brothers, study. Present yourself to God as one approved, a worker who has no need to be ashamed, rightly handling the word of truth. Don't be ashamed of your faith. Don't be ashamed that we serve an all-powerful, all-present, all-knowing, almighty God. Meditate on this word, 2 Timothy 2.15. Have a blessed day. Have a blessed weekend.